Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you're doing well. So this reading will be for you if you have uh, let's say Sagittarius, Taurus as your Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, North Node, or if you are dealing with a Taurus, okay, somebody who has Taurus placements. All right, guys, let's see what's going on for you. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Please tell me about Taurus. What does Taurus need to know? What's on Taurus's mind right now? Let's see, what's bothering you the most, Taurus? Being stubborn, Taurus. Being stubborn, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. So we have the Ace of Wands here, yeah. all right? Uh, oh, what? Three of Cups. Ace of Cups. That's an interesting combination. That's sick. All right. <sighs> okay, I'll have to tell you what I got first of all. So I'm going to have to, you know, there's not always just one way to read it, okay? So for some of you guys, I'm seeing, I'm getting a scenario of you telling your friends, your girlfriends or your boys saying, hey, you know, like, yeah, me and so-and-so, you know, we had sex and stuff like that. And your friends are like, what? Like, oh, okay. So your friends are like, go on, tell me more, tell me more, okay? And they're like, you know, they're still in love with me. They still want to be with me, okay? Aries, Leo, Sag, and Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, we have there. I'm also getting that... Um, It could be a thing where you guys are more p passionate about your friendship right now, okay? I don't know if that's the case for all of you. I feel like it's mainly what I just said. So I have to go with what comes to me first, okay? All right, but I'm, uh, there's a lot of new starts. I mean, somebody, somebody is very passionate about you, Taurus, okay? Someone is like, Taurus is the one for me. This is who I want. They... Clearly, they're clearly very sexually attracted to you and this person's in love with you okay and i feel like it's not just you telling your friends it's them telling their friends as well and it's not even as in a, i'm not getting like um like a school you know like 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 a, a childish kind of way of doing things it's kind of like yeah we did this yeah you know this is happening whatever Let's get into it. Okay, let's get into it. The star, Aquarius energy. Yeah, this person's put you in a pedestal, Taurus. This person is um, four of swords. So you guys may have had a break from this person. You might, you might have had a, I've, I mean, from how it started, it does feel like you guys, it's not just... Why would you randomly be like, oh, you know, I had sex with so-and-so. Obviously, you had to have some kind of break from them, okay? Okay. Some of you guys are not even speaking about it. Some of you guys don't even want to say nothing to your friends. Let's get into it. Temperance, Sag, and we have the sun, Leo. Okay. It's a lot of fiery energy here, okay? It's a lot of passion. A lot of passion, a lot of fire here. So um, this person is like they come in peace. They don't want to, um, I'm not seeing that they want to argue, fight, you know. You make them feel happy, Taurus. Let's just, let's just keep it real, yeah? You give them peace. You give them happy. You, you give them um, a lot of joy. And not just sexually. I'm talking about like, when you hold this person, when you look at this person, okay, when you cook for this person, when you eat with this person, when you go for drives, when you listen to music together, this, they were, they're thinking about times like that, Taurus. A lot, of, okay. All right, so 
done a couple of readings now Taurus yeah and you see last week a lot of people were fighting arguing in my readings a lot of people were, were fighting arguing a lot of truths coming out a lot of people are making up now okay so there's a theme going on here a lot of people are making up and like no I don't want this to end so I'm getting you guys may make up some of you guys this is make up sex okay unless I'm you know is what it is if it's not your story check it other placements but this is what i'm getting ten of pentacles guys you're just getting good cards this person wants everything with you taurus they want the white picket fence they want the two point was it 2.4 kids 2.5 kids whatever they, they they want everything with you yeah temperance the sun Ten of Pentacles, they just see you, even if you felt like there was other people, they don't, it's like, eh, okay, like a supermodel can come in and they'll still be like, nah, I love Taurus, wow, the Wheel of Fortune, and we have the Six of Pentacles, Six of Cups, I beg your pardon, they don't want this to end, the Wheel of Fortune, and, and the Six of Cups. They're not going anywhere, Taurus. Your person's not going anywhere. Somebody's come to their senses. Let's just put it like that, yeah? Someone's come to their senses. They, they, Taurus, you may have been drawing back your energy. You may have been um, doing whatever it is to, to make sure that you put yourself first and make sure that you're grounded and, you know, feeling good and not in a space where you're stressed over this person constantly. And this person's like, damn... I want Taurus in my life, man. Let's see how your person feels, Taurus. How does Taurus's person feel? Please say about Taurus's person. The Emperor. So they've come back. They they want they want to um we have the Emperor, Three of Swords. So they were heartbroken. They were heartbroken. And I feel like with the Seven of Cups, you made, you forced them. Seven of Cups and the Shadow side here. You forced them to look at themselves, Taurus. I don't know what you've been doing, Taurus, but you got this person to look at themselves. They were heartbroken. Okay? They may feel like there was somebody else that you were dealing with, with the Three of Swords and Seven of Cups here. They were like, damn, I'm losing control of my per I'm losing control. Like, I, I, I'm losing my person. Now, the emperor, one thing that they are in is in control. So, you may be dealing with the Aries, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, uh, Scorpio again. So, this person is, let me see more. You forced, you got this person to look at themselves, guys. You, the cards for you have come out like, like a damn rainbow yeah magical beautiful yeah and this person's like left out in the cold they're like shit man like ooh, that tourist brought me so much joy and i'm over here now tell me more about tourist's person please give me two more cards thank you page of cups so they're gonna send you a nice message okay they could be communicating with you or just telling you nice things okay one more card for Taurus, please, for their, for their person. What is their person going to do? Thank you. Nine of Swords. If you don't reply, they're going to be stressed out. You, if you've been out of communication with this person, it's been stressing them out big time. And they don't want that anymore. They want to be in communication with you, okay? King of Wands. They're going to chase you. You guys have pulled back your energy. And they're going to chase you, okay? They're... The King of Wands gets what he wants, yeah? As does the Emperor. Very fiery energy. If your person's got an Aries Leo Sag, they act like one. If they chased you at the start of the relationship, this is this person, okay? That's how you know. Right, guys, I hope that was helpful. Quite a nice reading. I'm glad someone come to their senses. You deserve it, Taurus. All right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in your next reading. Bye, guys.